Hi, in this video, we will see how we can create a two column layout using pages. At first, we have to open pages. After that, we have to choose a blank or any other template, whatever you want. I'm choosing blank and then I'm going to hit create to create a blank pages document. So once I click the create, it will create a blank pages for us. Now, we need some text before making it to column. So I'm copying some text from Wikipedia site just to show you how we can work. So I copied a couple of text from the Wikipedia site and just put it here. Now we have to make it to column. Right now it is on column. It is very simple and easy. To create a two column layout for this pages file at first, we can do one thing we can enable the layout view then it will be easier to understand whether it is making two column or three column or more columns okay it depends on our intention we sometimes need two column or more than that we can do that so let's enable the layout click on the view and then it will pop up this type of menu from here you will see show layout on option just click there and it will show you all the layout of this pages document so here you will see that there is on like uh, these texts are there and it's uh, outside this text there is a very light dark color very very light border is there so this is the border of this thing right now we have only one border like on box that means one column so if you want to make it two column then there will be two box inside this space okay now to enable that i mean to convert this on column document to multiple columns like two column or more than that we will do some few more steps it's very simple just go to the format if this panel is not appeared sometimes you will see that your pages are something like that so we have to click here format then the options will be appeared from this format option there is on tab like thing style layout more so we have to come this layout so once we click layout then you will see there is this type of panel will be appeared where columns indents tabs and so many other things will be there our intention was to create a two column or more than two column layout for this document so to do this thing we have to come this column options and beside this column you will see number one that means there is only one column if it is number two then it will be two column so to make it two column what we have to do we have to change this value right we can manually type two or three whatever the columns we want or we can press this up arrow or down arrow up arrow means it will increase the number of column and down arrow means it will decrease the number of columns okay so let's click this thing the up arrow i'm going to hit up arrow by mouse i'm clicking there and it changed to two and we'll see here there are two columns if we press again in the upper row it will create three columns so in this way we can do this thing or we can manually type one two or three whatever columns we want and if you press the down arrow it will decrease like this now it is two columns if i again click it will be one column if i try to again put down it will not do anything because by default it has only one column okay and you cannot go beyond one column so let's do one thing let's make it two column and it should look something like that okay so now we are able to create a two column layout for our pages document now uh, there are a couple of other options are there like equal column wide it will actually adjust both of the column same white okay and if you want to change like this right now uh, we are seeing that there is 3.08 inch and 3.08 inch both of the columns and there is a gutter 0.325 inch something like that okay so if we don't want this thing suppose this column will be bigger and this column will be smaller we can also do so to do this thing we have to uncheck this option and then we have to increase this thing so we can increase based on our requirement like for example we can make it like uh, four inch for example four inch 
and we can make it 2 inch for example we are doing this thing 2 inch okay so now in the left column it is 4 inch and right side it is 2 inch and we can also change the gutter also we can make it smaller or big based on the requirement so we can double click and then this field will be enabled and then we can remove this thing and put our desired uh, gutter like 0.25 for example okay and then once we are satisfied with the gutter just hit enter and then there will be the space between the gutter so in this way you can create uh, your own two column layout or one column or three column four column doesn't matter it's the same way and after doing this thing we can uh, disable this layout border and it will be the same so we have to go view and then we have to click on hide layout and it's done now uh, the layout is completely disabled and there is no layout i mean the layout border is not there but our document has two column layout and we customized it based on this requirement and uh, if we scroll down we'll see all the pages are in that format so in this way you can easily do and for any time if you wish that both of the columns will be the same you can also do you can just click here and then by default it will be adjusted automatically okay that's all guys it's very simple and easy in this way you can easily create a pages with two column layout hopefully by watching this video you are able to do this thing and if this video is helpful please hit the like button and don't forget to share this video with others thank you for watching see you on the next video